the murder case against Kimberly Kessler, charged with killing Nassau County mom and hairstylist Jolene Cummings last May. The state attorney's office just released a batch of new evidence this afternoon. And over the past hour, we've been combing through documents and photos. Several of those photos show blood inside Tangle's hair salon in Yulee. Kessler and Cummings both worked there, and investigators say Kessler was the last person to see Cummings before the 34-year-old mother of three vanished. Police have yet to find her body. News for Jocks reporter Corley Peel has been digging through the evidence. She's joining us now from our newsroom with what she has found. Corley? There's new photos from inside Tangles and hundreds of documents that were released. And these photos confirm that blood was found throughout the Tangles hair salon. Now here's a look at those photos. Investigators found blood on walls, chairs, cabinets, a bleach bottle, and in the wash sink drain at the Tangles hair salon. There's also 285 pages worth of documents with detailed search warrants and crime scene reports. When investigators searched Kessler's Kia Soul, they found $1,600 in her car. They also found five different driver's license for different states, all using the same name, Jennifer Seibert, which is one of her 17 alias names, according to deputies. Detectives also found a piece of Cummings jewelry near a wooded area in Griffin Road. There was also a cigarette pack with a bloody print that was also discovered in that area. In the night that Jolene was last known to be seen alive, witnesses told detectives that they saw activity and the light on inside the Tangles hair salon at the time it was supposed to be closed for the night. Now we are still digging through this new evidence and we will have another update tonight at 10. Reporting live from the newsroom, Corley Peel, Channel 4, The Local Station.